Hi right, guys. It is a steamy day here in paradise in the end times in Garfield, Texas. It is Friday, May 3rd, 2019. So this is a bittersweet day for your old depressed collapsitarian organic gardener because uh, what I'm doing out here is, I mean, I'm about three weeks, I should be doing this on June 1st, is uh, I'm harvesting my uh, organic garlic and onions. I put these in, when was it? Right around the 1st of November. Uh, they have been sitting in the ground ever since, and I love pulling out these but they say they're not ready to harvest yet but you know I have other plans in my life conflicting so uh, I am just gonna yank them on out of here because then I got to pull out of here in about nine days heading to New York and what I'm gonna do uh, since nobody is here to tend to this beautiful garden this summer I'm covering the whole thing with a bunch of plastic tarps and just letting this beautiful garden cook under the hot Texas sun while I am uh, gone this summer. And I'm going to come back next year and we're just going to plant it in wildflower seeds. So let's see, anyway, as I say, I'm about three weeks. All right, what do we got? Well. I don't know, that looks pretty nice to me. Man, you know, it's just like, it's just like Christmas. Coming out here and just pulling food out of the ground. Now this entire garlic bed, I don't know, this was, I think about three dollars worth of, of garlic. Uh, cloves that I planted uh, around the 1st of November. Oh man, I'm just going to keep the keep the dirt on them and uh, start drying them out. So I'm going to be bringing these along with me uh, on the way visiting friends from Texas to New York. Let's look at some of these onions. See, yeah, the onions, uh, they're pretty, and I'm sure they'll be delicious, but, uh, you know, I really wish I could have given these onions another month. But anyway, they will be delicious. Ah, uh, man, how are the white onions looking? Those were the purple, the... Now these are the yellows. Yellows are, yeah, the yellows are looking, yellows are looking good. Where are the whites? Is this the whites? There are the whites. Got purple, white, and yellow onions. Oh man, we're gonna have us some onion and garlic. And I, I already dug my carrots. Dug my carrots a couple of days ago. I didn't put many carrots in. Uh, but it was a fine crop of carrots. Look at that. You just pull this shit right out of the ground, people. This is 100% organic. No fossil fuels required. And this, uh... Chard kind of breaks my heart. I'm going to try to dig this up and uh, so it can get transplanted in Austin. Look at that gourd. Look at that, guys. Look at this. You know? It just don't get any prettier than that. Oh, man. I can just eat this stuff like you're a horse. Anyway, need to get over there and pick some snow peas. Speaking of horses, this is my 
not my, the next door neighbor's two horses who have taken over my back 40. Happy horses. Man, look at all the peaches. All the peaches that I will never get. I never get the peaches anyway. These damn squirrels. Damn squirrels won't let me have any peaches. But anyway, it is a fine, fine day. Here in the garden, for the last time in 2019 before covering it up with a plastic tarp for the summer. And look at those peaches. Anyway, get out there and enjoy your garden while you still can. And that canoe has my name on it too. I haven't decided whether I'm taking my canoe to New York or not, but I bet I will. Bye guys.